It's a law that's been on the books for years, meant to improve diversity in the city of Albuquerque. But as News 13's Haley Rush reports, an investigation shows the city has been ignoring that law. It's a city law that's been on the books for a long while. As I understand, this law was passed uh, 20 years ago. That ordinance states the city of Albuquerque should make sure a fair share of businesses owned by minorities and women get the chance to bid for city projects. That means reaching out to those businesses and then providing proof with quarterly reports. They're an important part of our economy and they represent a great portion of our economy. But an investigation by the city's Office of Internal Audit shows no reports exist and no one at the city was checking in to make sure the law was being followed. The city's response? There are so many laws on the books. We don't have someone scouring every single one. It's a rule that hasn't been followed for at least 15 years. This administration insists it wasn't ignoring the law on purpose. However, the, the perspective and the goals have always been abided by by this administration. Mayor Barry's chief of staff, Gilbert Montano, points to pay equity legislation it proposed. The goal to give companies willing to narrow the gap between gender salaries by at least 10 percent preference when applying for a city contract. The fact that this, uh, these quarterly reports weren't provided in the form and fashion as it re, uh, was spoken about in this ordinance does not mean that work isn't important and wasn't done. But the city says they will start following the law exactly as it's written immediately. And we'll abide by it and we should abide by it and for 15 years it should have been abided by. Haley Rush, KRQE News 13. The Office of Internal Audit says this was one of the most straightforward investigations it's ever done because there was no paperwork to go over since none existed, going back at least, as Haley mentioned, 15 years.